everyone and welcome back to my channel so today i have something exciting to show you guys i've been scouring the internet looking for some really really nice brushes i've been looking for every single place for some brushes that are comparable to the sigma brushes and i came across these brushes on ebay and they're called the jessup brushes the set that i got is actually the 15 piece set which comes in various of colors like pink white purple black and silver and all that jazz so i'm gonna list everything down below so if you have any questions about where to get these brushes i will have them linked in my description bar so now let's get on to the fun stuff so i'm really gonna tell you about these brushes i want to tell you if they're comparable to the sigma brushes but of course i do not have the set that i'm comparing it to so i have been using these brushes for about two and a half weeks and i really must say that i really do like them as you guys can see sorry for the mess it's really dirty i'm so lazy that i couldn't have the time to actually wash these brushes i'm telling you i am a brush hoarder so i basically buy brushes just not to wash them <laughs> so i just have so much brushes that it is so overwhelming especially when i go out and do freelancing i have at least 10 ziplock baggies of brushes that need to be cleaned so i just like having brushes on hand for those days that i'm so lazy and that's when i purchased these and these retailed for i think about 19.99 and they were having a sale so i got it for 18 dollars and a couple of change the seller is actually a seller that's from hong kong but that's based in the us so basically you can get these really fast you don't have to wait 30 days or two months or a whole year no you don't have to wait you can get these in like four days that's how long it took me to get mine so i'm gonna start with the face brushes that i have here and the set they have about a lot of face brushes i would say these are all the face brushes that you have here and the thing i like about this set is that they actually have what the use of each brush is on the brush so basically this one is saying it's a concealer brush i'm gonna give you guys up close pictures of each of the brushes so you guys can see so every single brush has the brand and has the name of what type of brush it is by the way jessup is actually a brand in the hong kong they do have some vendors that sell fake jessup so this one actually is a real jessup vendor and he has a certificate on his ebay account that you guys can actually look at to make sure you, you guys again the best quality as with china there's always fake products so there's always going to be something like this that's fake so be aware of that when you're purchasing so this brush right here is the tapered highlighter i use this to actually highlight my face like right here my nose and all that stuff the concealer one actually i use to clean up under my brows i also used it to apply my highlighter and i also used it to apply my contour so i used three things out of this brush and i haven't yet used this one i believe i would use this for blush actually i have a brush from coastal sense that is quite similar to this brush they're they're both really similar if you look at both of them they're similar in the way they're tapered at the ferrules if you look at the hairs they look the same basically almost the same so that is what i would use that for and that one is called the dual fiber powder brush and then we have the powder blush brush this one i actually don't like it for powder and blush i actually like it for contour powder like if i'm applying powder contour i would like to use this for that i will not use this for powder because it's not as dense as i want the powder brush i would definitely use for powder i actually use for powder today the thing i would say about this brush is that it packs on way too much product than you need so if you're gonna use it just make sure you tap lightly into your product and then buff it in because it is really dense and it packs a lot of product so i've noticed that as i was like putting it on it took a lot of product on here so be aware of that we have the tapered face i actually love this so much and the reason why i love it is that it is similar to one of the sigma brushes i forgot the name i will put the name on the video as the way it's tapered like that it's very similar and i use this for numerous functions i use this to sweep powder off under my eyes if i put my setting powder under there and i use it for 
actually swirling bronzer if I don't want a precise contour and I just want to have like bronzed face I will use that for that and if I want to apply blush I would just go like this with my blush and it will be fine I just love this blush it's like my favorite from the whole set we have this one it is called the large concealer this I actually use to kind of press my concealer under my eye in I would not use this for foundation that's a no-no. I do not see that as the purpose of this brush. I would use this just to place like my under eye concealer or corrector on the face, but not for foundation. So now we're done with the face brushes. We're going to go ahead and talk about the eye brushes. So this brush I'm going to start with is called the Large Fluff. And this brush definitely is not something I would use for eyeshadow because it's just way too big. Like really, like who's going to put this on their eyes like... Like, it's so huge. So, I found a use for this brush and I love it for that. It is really good for actually tapping the concealer and blending it out. That's what I love it for. I would never, ever put this on my eyelid and like tap, tap, tap. No, it would not work. It would just be everywhere. So, do not ever use this for your eyeshadow. It would not work at all. And that's actually a similar brush to another Sigma brush. I will list it down on the video too so you guys can see and then now let's move on to the other brushes that are more interesting we have the blending brushes of course i know everybody loves blending brushes this one is called just the blending it's a really really long fluffy blending brush i use this actually to apply transition like if i'm trying to buff it in this is what i use that for and then we have the taper blending which is what i use for my secondary transition color to kind of get right under the transition and like buff it in i use that for it and I, and these brushes work really fine they're very very comparable to my coastal scent ones that i use normally that's what i use when i do my videos and we have the small taper blending which is very, very similar i think to the e35 i will list everything down on the video so you guys can see and this one is really really nice for getting in those tight corners that you're like you're out of the area your crease this is really good for that and then we have the short shader this one it's kind of a funny brush i like it but and i don't like it uh i would use this just for like smudging like eyeshadow on the bottom lower line uh, i would not use this on my lid because it's way too small just like how this one was way too big this is like way too small for my lid because obviously my lid doesn't look like this of, of course right and then we have the definer brush or the flat definer this one i would actually use it for the same thing as i mentioned for this one and i would actually probably use this to clean up my brows because it's actually quite stiff it's not flimsy enough whereby i would lose control you know lose control this will work fine for that and then we have the lip brush which i really don't find this useful for my lip i don't really use lip brushes i use them on my clients but i don't use them on me this one would just be for inner corner highlight i would use this for inner corner highlight although it is designated for lip the eyeliner brush to be honest i haven't yet touched i don't really know what to say about it but from what i can see is that it is okay but it's a little flimsy so I don't know how well this will work with eyeliner. So that is it for these brushes. These brushes are so affordable, guys. I'm not being sponsored. I have to say that every time I do a review because everybody thinks that everything you get is sponsored. I brought this for my own money. Just Soup doesn't know I'm doing this video. I just thought that if you guys are interested, you guys can find good deals on brushes than spending money on MAC and other brands out there. So if you guys are interested in the brush set, I will have everything linked down below. I will have everything in the bottom bar. If I don't have anything that you're looking for on the bottom bar, just feel free to ask me questions. I like to hear your feedback. And I also like to know what other videos you're interested in. So make sure you leave that comment down below. And if you like this video, please don't forget to thumbs it up, favorite, and share it to your friends. And if you're new to my channel, please Please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys again for your love and support. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Did you guys know that most YouTube gurus wear pajamas when they're filming? Mm -hmm. Most of the time when I film, I mostly wait to when I want to film to brush my teeth.